respected elders your excellency distinguished guests of honor and my fellow human beings sawadee khap and at the very outset i want to congratulate all of you phenomenal people who have won the award that you have reached here till this point is no mean thing the jury panel sitting in front here consists of incredibly phenomenal human beings and if you can take a drop of their wisdom you will go back hugely enriched i am very thankful to merciful bhagwan god that today i have been given an opportunity to share some of my life experiences with you now that you have won the award you are looking very forward to getting that trophy sharing that news with friends family and social media i can understand that excitement i have been there but i will try to share with you something that you might find useful in the united states there is a very very small town very small town in which a priest was serving for 20 long years since it is a small town and everybody knows everybody he was very well known and respected one day the priest got a letter from the officials that he is going to be transferred to another town when he received that message he told everybody in the community and the congregation that listen i am going to move on but on this sunday i will give you a special lesson and sermon i want you to do only one thing and before you enter the church spend some time this week and read mark 17 mark 17 is in the bible so everybody nodded and said yes yes we will read so on sunday everybody came with gifts dressed well and finally the priest came to speak and he asked everybody has everybody read mark 17 everybody's hands went up yes yes we have read mark 17 so the priest said thank you very much there are only 16 chapters in mark there is no mark 17 and now i will proceed to give my sermon of life <laughs> you know why i shared this with you because we are our biggest enemy and what constitutes this laziness are two components one is laziness and another is being complacent the moment you win this award many many things will happen to you but to those who want to go higher i would like to share this message with you in 1950 Dr Kurt Richter of the Harvard University conducted an experiment on rats at that time the press and the media and the critics called it as a very torturous experiment in simple words he took rats and put them in a pool of water 
to check how long the rat could swim. And most of the rats swam, tried, tried to keep their face above the water. But roughly around the 15 minute time, the rats started drowning. And just before they would eventually die, the doctor picked them up, held them, dried them, gave them some warmth. After five minutes, he took the rats and put them in the pool of water. Tell me, take a wild guess, how long would the rats would have swam? 15 minutes, 20, 5 or 9? The answer is 60 hours. Can you believe that? 60 hours. What I want to convey by that is have belief in yourself and a higher power. The rats were thinking that after the first time we have been taken out, we will be protected and we will survive. Just that single belief made them swim for 60 hours. That singular belief has to come first from yourself. Just have a single-minded focus on what you do best. Because the man who tries to please everybody pleases none. And then know that you are special. There is a higher power whether it is the God, whether it is Bhagwan, universal energy or the divine Buddha. Make a relationship with that. I will be brief because you have had such fantastic achievements. I, I am sure that everybody went to school here, right? Is there anybody who didn't go to school? Fantastic. What do we learn in school first? A, B, C, D in whatever language, right? Everybody knows A, B, C, D? Yes or no? Then we learn numbers. 1, 2, 100. 1, 2, 3, 4. Everybody knows number? Yes or no? Fantastic. My question to you is, the alphabet starts with A, right? The most common alphabet. Do you know, now no cheating, no Googling, because we are going to defeat Google here, all of us. How many times the alphabet A, A for Apple, comes in the name spelling of any number. For example, O-N-E, T-W-O. How many, tell me, how many times the alphabet A comes in the name spelling of any number between 1 to 100? Anybody? Take a wild guess. That's a good answer. How many people knew that? Let me tell you none. Because the next level is the alphabet A does not make appearance in the name spelling of numbers from 1 to 999. Can you believe that? Yes, yes, when people ask me, give me a management tip, tell me about a gym, Will meditation work? I always say, 
let's start with the alphabet understanding the alphabet what I am trying to share with you is there is a lot of information but you have to choose quality information and quality people when you choose quality information and quality people you will save yourself from ordinary experience this August gathering today is celebrating success success means different things to different people I don't know the meaning of success what I definitely know is be a man of value then a man of success in simple words who is a man of value a man of value is whosoever comes in your life your customer your executive your officer try to deliver a little bit extra than what they expect from you now that the crown is on your head I will not take much time I know all of you want those awards and going to fine dining and everything now the crown the Taj is going to come to you so I must conclude with this Dushman to mil jata hai Dushman to mil jata hai Pehen kar taaj sir pe Dushman to mil jata hai Pehen kar taaj sir pe Zara Dost bhi dhund le Ord kar libaz fakir ke Find good friends, celebrate yourself. God bless you.